I have a distinct memory in the 80s of a video recorder, video player coming home with a remote, but a cord that stretched from the video all the way across the lounge room so that you could sit in your lounge chair, push it, and it was connected to the video. That, oh my God, that was the height of technology. Me and my brother's got an Atari for Christmas, which was just like unbelievable, it was so good. And we also had a scale strip. that was quite good. But back in the day, they were good, really good. The gadgetry we had in the house was um, a, the one of the first video machines, which was so exciting and had huge levers, clunk to record, clunk to pause, clunk to eject. But it worked and we knew how it worked, it was simple. Um, and then everything got a bit more complicated after that. Mm. Uh, the height of gadgetry in our house is probably a Rubik's Cube. Um, we did have one of those, my dad had one of those big phones that looked like uh, half a house. I remember my dad used to hire a video camera, we used to make family films each year. We didn't own one because they're so expensive. But that was an exciting piece of kit and it was, you used to have to carry a VHS player yeah. over your shoulder yeah. and strap. It was a full-size VHS player and you'd hold the camera. Um, and I remember that very clearly and being very exciting. Mm. Yeah, we used to yeah. rent a video camera for like, uh, not me and you. No. Uh, we used to rent a video camera in our family yeah, and I would do um, Daniel's Film Festival it was called. Yeah. And uh, I would just uh, film my cat. <laughs>